day 11 of Vlogmas. My name is Lisa and I'm coming to you from the Yo Yarn Girl YouTube channel. Just drinking some tea and this is just going to be a quick catch up to open up my day 11 advents. Today I get an extra one from Mandy's Making. Super excited to open this one. And I have my Ruby and Roses, and I also have my swap partner. So, and you know what? I did not bring in my card for my Ruby and Roses, so I'm gonna go grab that, and I will be right back. Okay, I am back. So, all right. So, let's just go ahead and get right into Day 11, Ruby and Roses. Okay. Uh, see the name? Sorry, my chair is squeaky. <clears throat> Apologize. My husband's in the kitchen, if you can hear that. Well, this is called Even Tide, or is it Ever Tide? <laughs> I'm gonna put it across the top. I think it's Even Tide Adventure. Love these colors. Come on, focus, focus, focus. There we go. beautiful blues and some pops of pink in here. Really, really like that. So, Ruby and Roses. Day 11. And now I am going to open up my swap partner, Day 11. Super pretty. There we go. Love these. And I think I was looking at these. I think they're self striping. So they're going to make great little sweaters. Ornament sweaters for the tree with that self striping. Okay, and now we're going to go to my Mandy's Makings, and I got four of these. They're four Mondays of December. It came with these little wooden hearts on there. Cute. Cute, cute. Staples. Sorry, TV went on. This 
So those are my advents for day 11. So, so excited about those. And I do want to bring one other thing before I sign off for the night. I had promised to share, we're coming to the end of my cow, the festival that Christy Archer and I are hosting. And I wanted to share um, the prizes that I'm going to be giving away on Instagram and over on Ravelry. So this will be one. There'll be two skeins of this. I only have one over here with me now, but this is a DK weight yarn. It's 50% alpaca, 25% Peruvian Highland, Merino wool blend, and 25 Surrey alpaca. It's a beautiful soft yarn. This is one of, this is a knit crate and I had ordered a bunch of this to make a sweater and had some leftovers, so. It's a really pretty blue. And then this will be the prize. This is a yarn, um, it's Cloudborn, I believe. They no longer make this. This is a sock yarn, and you will receive two skeins of this. A winner will um, get this. So one of the, um, this will, one will be for the winner over on Instagram, and one will be for the winner over on Ravelry. So these are the prizes. There will be a few little extras that I have. Um, that I will be throwing in with these, but yes, we have until the 15th. So if you are still interested in throwing a vest on the needles, throw it on the needles. Hashtag is Vestival 2023 Cal over on Insta and make sure you get it in there. Don't have to finish it. You'll be entered for prizes and the same over on my Ravelry, which is um, Yo Yarn Girl. And my username on Ravelry is yarngirl67. So those are the prizes, along with some extras that will um, be thrown in with those uh, skeins of yarn. But yes, so we have a DK weight. And then there's going to be a sock weight. All right, so I think this is going to be it for day 11. And I will see you tomorrow. Well, hello and welcome to day 12 of Vlogmas. We are halfway through and today is my last day opening up Advents from my swap partner. And then I will continue to share my Ruby and Roses each day and my knitting that I accomplish. But before I open up any of my Advents, and I apologize because I am in the middle of a row and I'm hoping this is a knit row, I think it is. But I'm in the middle of a row of a what I'm using my advents for. And I showed uh, there will probably be a little bit of footage. There's not a lot today. I've had a really busy morning. I'm working this afternoon, so I'm not going to have a lot. I actually might combine 12 and 13, um, but we'll see. So this is my little ornament sweater that I'm making out of my advent from my swap partner. Let's see if it'll focus. I know it wants to focus on me. There we go. And I realized after opening these, <laughs> probably like five days of opening them, um, the yarn that I have from her, which she dyed, is all self-striping yarn. So these are going to make cute, cute ornaments. So I am super excited about getting more of these off the needles um, and onto my Christmas tree. 
So, and I apologize, I'm all, I'm ready for work. So I have to dress up, <laughs> so, or somewhat dress up. But anyways, yeah, so I'm super excited. And this is, um, yeah, the first one with that advent that I'm getting done. I did one with um, yarn from, that I had from a pair of socks that I made out of uh, Legacy Fiber Arts uh, yarn. But yeah, so I'm really excited. Um, what is everyone knitting on? What are, what are you doing with your advents? Are you waiting to use them at a different time? Um, are you going to try and get through things? I kind of have had not a lot of luck on my cozy knitter socks. I'm going to pick them back up. Um, hopefully on my days off, I may get caught up. I'm definitely far behind, but I'm not. There's no pressure, no stress. Remember, this is a no pressure, no stress advent season for me. But I have a couple of things that I would like to take you guys along with um, and share. So one is I want to do the Christmas market downtown in uh, downtown Denver. So I might be able to get that um, to do that on Thursday, maybe, fingers crossed. Um, so yeah, if I can get that done, that would be super exciting. And um, there's a light show that I would like to go to and may get that in and then we will be doing i'll be doing some more baking and sewing here over the next week so i have quite a bit planned i also have um done quite a bit on my poncho the korean poncho that i'm knitting along um i'm not knitting i'm just i'm copying along with uh marilisa and christina of chelsea lux yarns marilisa of girl meets yarn they are knitting the Korean poncho, and so I decided to jump in and start my own. And I am actually using my 2022 advent from Chelsea, Lux Yarns. So that's what I'm using to knit it. But I just started day two's color. And so again, I'm not anywhere near where they are with it, but I'm definitely getting through it and loving the way it's looking so far. So I will share. You probably won't be able to tell color. To, you might be able to tell, but I've switched colors right there. And I'm using this along with an Expression Fiber Arts. Um, th I'm through my short rows. There's some short rows in here. I'm uh, using this with a lace weight, Expression Fiber Arts, just a plain white lace weight as opposed to a mohair. But I would like to maybe do one in a mohair because I think that would be great. And currently I'm doing some increases. And yeah, I am really loving this so far. So I know that day three and four are a little bit more dramatic um, colors for the advent for 2022 from uh, Chelsea Lux. So I'm really looking forward to getting those in here as well, but I love those. So, all right. So that's that on those projects that I'm working on. Let me go ahead and open up my day 12 advents. And I'll start with my swap partner. Let's see if it'll focus better. It does not want to focus. There we go, there we go. Day 12. Okay, so day 12 from my swap partner, Sonia. Sonia, I really hope you enjoyed the um, advent that I put together for you. So we are coming to an end. And wow, I love this color. Mm-hmm. <laughs> see if I can get this one to focus. There we go. Love it, it's deep pinks and browns and some purple. I really, really like this. So thank you so much, Sonia. You did such a great job in nailing the colors for me and in putting together this advent. Um, I truly, truly have enjoyed it and I can't, I, it's just gonna keep giving to me as I knit through all of my mini skeins and make my little treat ornaments. I may do some hats. So I just got a pattern, a free pattern for some hats and I'm thinking about doing a couple of these for um, in hats versus sweaters. So I'll have hats and sweaters on the tree. But there is day 12 from my swap partner. And I absolutely love it. So thank you, Sonia. Where is 
my day. Oh, there we are. <sighs> Sorry. Day 12 for my Ruby and Roses. Well, and I will put the name up across the screen for this because I don't have my card here with me. Like this a lot though. Look at those colors. Very nice, very nice. So, day 12, Ruby and Roses. All right, guys, I am going to finish up here and I may bring you a little bit more footage um, throughout the day, but may not. So if I don't, I probably will end up combining my day 12 and 13 for all of you to see. Um, but yeah, I hope everyone is enjoying this season and I am definitely enjoying it. It's been hectic. Um, I've had a few things that have taken my attention away from being able to do additional footage but um, more to come. So there'll be more things that I'll be sharing in the next couple of weeks ahead. But yeah, until later or tomorrow, happy making everybody.